Hello and welcome back to Factorio. And we are researching rocket silos. But that doesn't mean we're close to being finished. We got we got a bit left to do here. Um, I'm making centrifuges. They actually stack pretty high. I've got 33. They came from one stack. I guess they stack to 50. Uh, that's very odd. That they would stack that high, but things like refineries and chemical plants would only stack to 10. But, uh, okay. That's how it is. Oh, also, um... Yeah, ore, plates. We're not doing too good there. Um, I gotta upgrade these to... Uh, blue belts. Let's grab some of those. Grab those. I got, um... These splitters take so many materials to make. I'm only stacking them to 10 here. Not even one full stack, just um, 10. So it'll load 10 in here. And then I've got some circuits on the unloader that uh, will only enable it if it detects more than 10. So yeah, because they take so much lubricant And uh, we're just running out of circuits here. Yeah, copper plates is a problem. Um, I'm going to need some underground, express underground belts. Yeah, I'm going to limit this to uh, 20. Oh, uh, no, 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 that should be less than. If underground belts less than 20, then unload it. Okay. Now we need iron chests. How many? 17. And repair turrets. I'm not making repair turrets right now. 10. Five. Uh, we can set up repair turrets though pretty easily. Pistol, stone furnace, lamp. Uh, do I have pistols on the network? I think I do. They take 2.5 seconds crafting. Okay, that's fine. One assembler will do. Eleven lamps. Stone furnaces and pistols. Okay, I don't think I have pistols. I know I don't have stone furnaces. That's five stone. I 
I can set those up if I can find them. There they are. Stone. Alright, let's bring this stone over. And uh, after this, we're going to set up the centrifuges. And we'll put a bunch of furnaces in a provider chest. And pistols. Oh, more stone. Uh, okay. I'll just borrow that. There we go. We'll build it in such a way that it's expandable. We can just add more down here. Four stacks. They stack to like five or ten. Yeah, so we'll get a bunch of stacks. Okay, copper plates. Okay. We're already requesting pistols there. I could just grab them off the belt. Right here. Yeah. Save the bots some... Trouble. Okay, that's repair turrets. And that's all I need for the express underground belts. Now, we're good. Uh, thank god. Oh my god, these only take 40 lubricant. Holy hell. They cut me some slack there. 40 lubricant compared to the 1,200 lubricant for the splitters or the 125 for the transport belts. Oh god. Alright, 
Uh, let me grab some more belts. So I got enough supplies here to maybe upgrade something. The ore belt, I think. Yeah, or because we got we have a, a blue belt here, and it's just getting. No, even if I upgrade, it's not the issue. It's just all getting used up here. We need... We need to er insert some ore, like... Downstream somewhere. Get another blue belt in here and then combine it. I have enough ore to do that. Should be easy. Let's see if I can get a red belt of ore. Down here, I can combine it with this one. That'll help out quite a bit. I just want to get something going real quick because I want to go... ...and mess with nuclear. Nuclear. So I'm just going to Mickey Mouse this. together here. Alright, there we go. That That's going to help quite a bit, I think. Yeah, that's not going to be enough to fill up this uh, blue belt, but it'll be very close. A lot of it's getting used down here. And uh, down here for science. There it goes. Whoops. Oh, God. Let's upgrade this to blue. There we go. We don't have to upgrade the whole thing. 
that up until this point. Uh, that'll be fine. Okay, now I'm going to have to do the same thing with copper eventually because it's all getting used up at the green circuits. I'll do that off camera for now. Let's go ahead and play around with nuclear. There's not a lot of room here. Processing. Let's do it. Uh, how long does this take? Twelve seconds. And it requires 10 ore? Okay, I... I think... Whoops. I think that's enough centrifuges. We don't have a lot of ore here. Okay, now we need to... Yeah, we can just do this. Uh, we need a... F well, we don't really need a filter inserter. What are we going to get? Uranium 235, 238... And uh, I'm going to get a lot more 238. I don't need to store that many. Okay. Uh, that's good. Amazing. Now we do need sulfuric acid, which is fine. Oh, we got no transport belts. How am I doing on power? I added a few steam engines. Yeah, we're doing not great, but okay. What the heck? Steel is not doing good. Did my miners die? Okay, I broke this. That's what happened. Alright, something to fix for later. Uh, I got my... Sulfuric Acid tanked up there. Oh, let's go down here and um, empty out the light oil. 
Still have to do that once in a while. No way around it. We got to bring it up here, up here next to the steel. And um, the sulfur, sulfuric acid will be distributed to adjacent miners. So all we have to do is uh, get it flowing in the first one here in the row, and then we should be okay. Yeah, I think uh, we have more ore than I'll ever need. Or more uh, centrifuges. So it's going to consume a little bit less than one per second. And these are mining speed 0.5. Mm, I don't know, it's going to be close. But uh, if I need more ore, we've got ore up there. What's going on here? Yeah, they're starting to attack down here. I gotta be careful I don't get caught off guard. They send a huge wave of uranium down here. After an unfortified, in an unfortified location. I mean, there's turrets everywhere, but some are better guarded than others. Some portions of the wall. Um, one entity is missing construction robots. Is there something damaged? Alright, this process is going to take... A while. Maybe I should train up some... Ore from down there. Yeah, we can get this done quicker. Here, let's get our steel back in business. pathetic amount of steel. It's not really used for much, though. Okay, I am hauling in... Yeah, I am hauling in uh, copper. No, I'm not hauling in. I'm producing it right here. This is one... Uh, one red belt worth copper. Okay. Oh 
man, you know what? I need construction robots. I don't want to make another one of these by hand. I don't think I have any construction robots. Explosive rocket. Yeah, I still need the personal roboport. Well, we have the accumulator centrifuge. We need the energy shield. Ah, yes, the enhanced flamethrower. How do we get that? Flamethrower 2? Um, oh right, I, I don't know how to get this one. We don't know the prerequisites. Could be a bug, or... There's a prerequisite I don't know about, but I don't know what it could be. Napalm rockets? Let's get... Any prerequisites. Any low tier stuff. That I don't have yet. Explosive rocket. Yeah, I get that. Yeah, a lot of these are just upgrades. They don't give me new recipes. Uh, improved tank. That's a new recipe. Defense trap. Okay, yeah. Just get all of that. Well, I guess we can do one smelting line by hand. Uh, let's dump some of this material here. Alright, let's get a new, ouch, smelting line. Or copper. I don't have construction robots, but that's okay. Still should be able to get it done pretty quickly. Alright, nearly done here. And we're progressing through this uh, research pretty quickly. Not surprising. It's a uh, low tier research. All right, we need power. Now it's going to be a little bit weird because we're we're going to have a copper smelting line and then an iron smelting line and then another copper smelting line. Two coppers on each side. Um, I'm not going to bother changing it around. We'll, uh, we'll have to deal with that. Ignore it. Just ignore it. Don't look at it. Everything is a-okay. How many miners is that? 60. Okay, that's enough for one red belt. Okay, this is not quite going to be enough. 
for two red belts, I think, but... Yeah, 90. Not, not quite. Uh, but we do have... Well, I don't know. With, um... Productivity bonuses, maybe. Plus 20%. Okay, input priority left. So we use up this ore first. Okay, output priority right. Uh, input priority right. Oh dear god. Power. Yeah, I was wondering what the heck is going on? Why are we not producing? Um, I knew power would be an issue. It was dumb of me to ignore it for so long. I mean, everything was running fine and would run fine as long as production was like a third of maximum but if everything was running then yeah we're gonna have problems real quick uh yeah we're just not getting coal here Can I stop research? Let me stop that real quick. Whoops, I shot it. No, don't shoot it. Okay. Uh, there we go. <laughs> Trying to find the one that was damaged. Yeah, getting back from this, uh, it's going to be a little bit tricky. I suppose I could disconnect it from the grid temporarily. I didn't plan for this, so... Yeah, I, I mean... Ah, well, it's fine. I 
I didn't design my base in such a way that I could just shut off parts of it. We'll just borrow all this coal. Okay, and I disconnected the coal right here so we won't be pumping any more into the bus here. There we go. Let's see if I can get the coal miners going without everything else. Uh, disconnect that. Okay, that'll get these miners going. What about these? There we go. Got all the coal miners running. Okay, we'll let that run for a minute. And then we'll start everything back up. But, um... Oh, I don't have a radar over there. And I'm, I'm gonna have to add some more... Oh, God. And I have to add some more steam engines. I think I got... I'm not doing too bad on steam engines and boilers. It's really just the... Uh, the coal running out that was the issue. But uh, getting this... Second red belt of uh, copper is going to be pretty sweet. I don't know how yet I'm going to feed it in, but I'll figure that out. Alright, I'm going to end the episode here. I'm going to turn on everything. Turn everything back on in just a minute and see if I can connect this copper line up to my bus. And, um... Yeah, see if we can alleviate some of these shortages here. We did pretty good with the ore, iron ore, right there. Alright, thank you for watching, and I'll see you soon.